Welcome. Today, we're tackling an intriguing debate, grizzly bear versus moose. You've probably heard wild claims, like a grizzly bear decapitating a moose with a single paw swipe. Let's set the record straight. Such an event has never been recorded. The idea that a bear would decapitate a moose with one swipe is simply unrealistic. First, let's examine the physical differences and fighting styles of these two formidable creatures to understand who might come out on top in a direct confrontation. Size and Physique Grizzly Bear The grizzly bear, scientifically known as Ursus arctos horribilis, is a powerful predator reigning over the northwestern region of North America, particularly in Alaska. These bears are built to endure harsh conditions, boasting coarse fur and thick layers of fat. The size of grizzlies varies depending on their location. Interior grizzlies, like those in Yellowstone, weigh around 600 pounds, while coastal grizzlies in Alaska can weigh up to 900 pounds or more, standing about seven to nine feet tall. Moose. The Alaskan moose, the largest subspecies of moose, is a colossal herbivore. Bulls can weigh around 1,300 pounds by fall and stand between six and a half to seven feet tall. Their massive bodies are supported by sturdy legs and strong shoulders, allowing them to carry their large antlers, which can weigh up to 50 pounds. Grizzly bear. Grizzlies are known for their brute force and brawling techniques. They are adept at grappling with robust hind limbs that allow them to stand and wrestle. Their paws, equipped with three to four inch claws, are primarily used for digging and manipulating rather than swiping. Grizzlies utilize their strong bites by targeting any accessible part of their opponent's body, causing widespread injuries rather than concentrating on a single area. Moose. Moose, especially bulls, are known for their aggressive behavior particularly during the rutting season. They use their massive antlers to ram opponents and their sharp hooves to kick. Fighting technique involves headbutting and using their body weight to knock down adversaries. Speed and agility. While neither the bear nor the moose is particularly aerodynamic, both possess remarkable endurance. Grizzlies have a high percentage of slow twitch muscle fibers, giving them great stamina and the ability to engage in prolonged fights. Despite their bulk, they are surprisingly agile and capable of short bursts of speed. Moose can match grizzlies in a sprint, reaching speeds of up to 35 miles per hour, but they lack the bear's agility. Real world encounters. Grizzlies and moose do encounter each other in the wild, but detailed records of these interactions are sparse. A study from 1992 indicates that grizzlies typically prey on moose calves and, less frequently, adult females. There are no recorded cases of a grizzly bear successfully killing a bull moose and surviving the encounter. Fighting styles and weaponry. The only documented instance of a grizzly and an adult moose both dying from their injuries suggests the moose inflicted severe trauma on the bear. Verdict. Who would win in a fight between a grizzly bear and a bull moose? Given the data, it appears that the bull moose would have the upper hand, albeit with great difficulty. The moose's size, powerful antlers, and kicking ability present significant challenges for the bear. The grizzly's usual strategy of grounding its prey would be ineffective against the moose's height and fighting style. Therefore, while it would be a brutal and hard-fought battle, the bull moose would likely emerge victorious more often than not. Don't forget to watch my videos with the same topics. Thanking you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe.